It did dawn on me at some point, music is being written by someone somewhere. It took a minute before I really realized that someone could actually be me. You know, I, I grew up in the suburbs, I didn't come from a musical family necessarily, in fact my father can't really hear. I guess in my own personal life there was a, there was a premium placed just on the ability to hear to begin with, because half of my parents couldn't. So it became sort of an elevated thing that I was aware of. I had a gift, not everybody had. Once I realized there are people somewhere writing this music and that that person could be me, I started thinking, how would I get there? You know, and, and I was a musician, but I didn't really want to be in a band. I didn't really want to go on tour or play my hit songs if I were so lucky enough to have them. I wanted to change styles all the time. And I think that naturally led me into film music. There really is a big leap from realizing somebody somewhere is writing music and then realizing that could actually be you. Once I made that leap, there were a lot of steps along the way. Uh, one of the things I recommend to nearly every composer that I ever talk to who's coming up or, or looking into the field is to try to get an internship with a composer. But that said, by the time you do that, you probably need to be able to write music already. So where are you going to learn those skills? And certainly Berkeley is one place to do that and it's the finest in the world in my opinion. Once you have that skill, you then need to get absorbed in the culture of filmmaking, which you know really takes place out here in Hollywood or, or in New York. Once you get to these places, you need to find a way in. And you know, internships is one of them. But the thing to remember is, I'm speaking about being a composer. We think of film scoring as the composer, but there are so many other jobs, actually, that take place within that community. There's Obviously, there's the composer, but there will be other arrangers on the team with the composer. Then there's orchestrators who take that music and translate it into the, the, into the score for the orchestra to play, which is a, a different skill, actually. Then there's music copyists and preparation that happen that translate that into actual sheet music that goes to the orchestra. Then there's a conductor. There's the musicians, obviously, playing it. There will be a, usually a team, actually, of music editors that, um, you know, keep up with anything that's changing the picture as the film evolves. And this is just off the top of my head, the many roles that exist within the film scoring community. Composers all have assistants. I have two or three myself at all times, usually aspiring composers. But th there's just so much work, actually. And nowadays, with the advent of streaming, there's so much content. There's so many more composers working. And video games is another avenue. I don't think there's ever been a better time to, to try to get into film scoring. There's just so many opportunities now.